We're here live at JCW in Edison, New Jersey, and I'm with Renee Michelle. Welcome, finally welcome to Edison. Hi, thank you so much for having me. It's, a, it's actually a pleasure. Uh, we've been trying to track you down on uh, Facebook for a couple of months, but we finally got you live. Yeah, definitely. I'm very glad that you finally get a hold of me. <laughs> Uh, a couple questions I want to ask you. One of the main things we always ask independent wrestlers is, is um, how you got into the business and who was your biggest influence? Um, how I got into the business is that um, I will admit that I never grew up in wrestling and uh, for two friends of mine took me to a DNA or WWE event and how I was discovered was by Dwayne Gilbert, as you all, everyone should, everyone yeah. knows. So then um, from there, it pretty much, um, as much as he was trying to get me to get in, I was simply refusing, absolutely. You know, I looked at him like he had six heads on his shoulder. So um, he finally convinced me. I gave it a try, and then ever since then, I became addicted to it. I fell in love with the sport, and I don't have any regrets for it at all. Well, there's nothing wrong with that. I mean, um, as you can see, it's got a very large following, so you're not the only one that gets addicted to wrestling. Uh, the big difference is that you get in there and you know kick some butt, and, and we just watch. Uh, <laughs> uh, what what nationality are you? Uh, my nationality is Cuban, Native American, Italian, Black, Irish, Spanish, Cherokee, French, and German. Okay, I should have. It. Yeah, there's a lot there. Well, because well, you know, I see the feather in your hair, and I know a lot of the pictures that you take are very. Uh, Native American like and um, so I, just, I, I felt I needed to ask you I, I figured you had so I know it wasn't a gimmick I know you had some in you yeah well I mean as from what I see there's not that many Native wrestlers you know you have your massive amount of Latinos and you know African American descent and other fourth of nationalities but there's not that much of Native American descent, so of course, you know, I want to bring that to the table, and not only on top of that, it stands out, it stands out, you know, when, when do you ever see, like, a bunch of Native Americans? Uh, I couldn't, maybe since the 80s when uh, Tatanka was running around and uh, Chief J Strongbow, yeah. I, I honestly, I, I recently I can't remember any to date. I'm sure there is some in Independent, but obviously you don't get to see them on television. Uh, what do you have coming up for 2014? Well, on the 22nd, I will be attending the Maryland Championship Wrestling from there, so be sure to check me out from there. I'll be teaming up with Nui Togoa, and I'll be going against Kobian and Jesse K. Okay, and for your fans out there who uh, will be listening to the show, because we did tag you on the, the banner that we posted today, uh, how can they reach out to you to you know give their wishes and find out what's going on with you? Um, they can reach me on facebook.com slash one Renee Michelle or you can get me on Twitter one Renee Michelle or Instagram you know I always like taking pictures so I'm looking forward to hearing everyone's opinions about it at Lady RM okay awesome I appreciate your time uh, sorry we couldn't get to see you in the ring against uh, t uh, Tina but you know I'll get her next time I'll definitely get her next time Swabo! <laughs> uh, this is uh, Coach Kev live from JCW NC New Jersey with Renee Michelle uh, back to you guys.